Hi, I'm Deborah, Deborah Beniago. Um, the last name is Garnier. I was born here and I moved, um, the whole family moved to New Zealand. And from New Zealand I moved to uh, the UK. And I've been in the UK for a little while. But I've been visiting Ghana on and off and something's been pulling me back home. So I bought a property here and I said to myself last year, that's it, I'm leaving. So I dropped everything in the UK and decided to come back home. So I've been here for a little while, a few months, <laughs> and um, it's been good to connect and um, the joy that you feel by coming back home is just amazing. I can't explain it. I could be earning a lot more money in the UK. I'm a dental hygienist by profession. Um, but the peace and the joy, the love, the sunshine, the people, connecting with new people, you cannot buy that. So I'm back home. For good, I hope. <laughs> Introduction. Introduce yourself, come on, there you go. Okay, now, I am Mohammed Isaac Nana Kofi Etua Adesin. Thank you for loving me. Yeah. All right, um, I met um, Bamani. 2007, and we've been working up to now. Uh, through him, uh, I was able to get a marriage to African American who lives from who lives at uh, Cleveland, Ohio. Um, we been married for about, I think, um, five years now, since 2018, up to now. Um, we are also trying to, you know, do things so that we can help people from diaspora. And we've been, we've been able to acquire almost about 10 acres land from Elmina, um, KEA district. But when you drive from Elmina Junction to the place, it's almost about 25 minutes with them. And this land is almost at the, um, near the ocean. It's almost about ocean view land. You know, when you are there, you, you, you walking from the land to the ocean is just by three minutes, you walk, you walk to the ocean. And this land also is selling. We are quiet because we want to help those who want to repatriate and then maybe they want to be their own dream house to feel good, get the energy, get the peace. So this land also is there that, you know, uh, if anybody wants to acquire some, you know, uh, you know, I will give the details uh, when we get to um, keep close as soon as the tour is going on. But I start now, you know, I have my card, I'll give out with if anything you can get in touch with me. So I think basically this is a few words that I, I, I will say. Thank you very much. Good evening. I'm uh, Quentin Johnson uh, and uh, my wife is here. And we are here from uh, Dallas, Texas. But I just want to say I started out, I grew up in Mississippi, the same area that uh, Emmett Till was in. I was uh, a few years old at that time, very young. But uh, in that, uh, just move on up to the early 60s was when I first began to hear about Africa. We got interested in the press with Africa. That's in the early 60s when I began to hear about Marcus Garvey and uh, on and on. Uh, Kwame and Kuma, and on and on, there was guys even back then who were in Mississippi from South Africa who had uh, escaped the part time and were there even back in the early 60s. <coughs> then, until today, which is my first time, I've always wanted to make it to Africa, and finally I made it. And that's it. Hello, my name is Vera 
Johnson. This is my husband, Quentin. I've been trying to get to Africa since 1995, and he finally married me and brought me here. So, but one of the things is so enriching. Uh, my husband and I have been watching videos after videos after videos, how to pack, how to do all these different things. Basically, none of them really work. But uh, the thing about it, being with Bamani, he is so patient and kind, and he's a man of his word. He's a person that you want to travel with because he's going to make it happen. You put the money in his hands and it's on. And he knows what he's doing. And I trust him and we are interested in opportunities in Ghana or Gambia. So that's why we are here. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah. <laughs> My name is Douglas Atkinson. Born in Jamaica. So I can where are where you from? Chicago or anywhere? Oh. I can always quote a Jamaican song. No matter where you come from. Down as your black man. You got Africa. I am here. My family sent me here to be the sacrificial lamb to see what's going on. But they know that I never left Africa, even growing up as a kid. And today, I choose to be here. Today is my 72nd birthday. My name is Godwin. I'm a Ghanaian in Ghana Immigration Service. <laughs> I took work to see how to suffer. I'm a Ghanaian. I, as a child, was a member of the Ghana Young Party. It's like one of wow. So now I'm here as an, uh, a member of this political party. It's about uh, trying to bring Nkrumah's view, Nkrumah's views into reality in Africa. Mm -hmm. We are all over in Africa, starting very soon. And in Ghana, we already registered as a political party. Mm -hmm. This party is not about any person. It's about Africa. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you, Peter Tupuan. Uh, good evening, and uh, I would like to welcome all of you here. You are most welcome to Ghana. Uh, my name is Jose Ojo Ahenakwa. I'm an African living in Ghana. Yes, we are all Africans, and wherever you are, you are an African. So if you're in Ghana, you are an African living in Ghana. Yes, I'm also a member of ACUP, and uh, I also believe that it's about time that we come together to mobilize ourselves as Africans and to look within ourselves for progress and for development. So uh, this evening, uh, I came with my team, and uh, basically, we are also uh, working on a project called Ubuntu Solidarity Project, which seeks to mobilize ourselves and form economic, uh, I mean, project teams to implement businesses and ideas. So thank you so much. This is a little bit about me. Thank you so much. Hi, I'm Leanne Brown. Uh, I'm originally from Mississippi, so I can make with my brother there. Uh, actually, now I live in there. Washington DC area and been there for many years. Uh, so when I did the test, my, my, my roots was spread all the way from uh, Senegal, Mali, in the north, all the way to the Congo. But Ghana, which means Ghana is there. So when many people are all in one, I'm very proud to be there. And also, uh, and this is my second uh, uh, trip to Ghana, but the first time being at the conference where I could actually invest. I got ideas I want to pass on, and I want them to also, you know, give me ideas. I already connected with at least uh, one person here about ideas to pass on. So, and so, uh, uh, so if you look for ideas, and I want to invest small investment, you know, to start. Hopefully, with the universities and span out from there. So anyway, I'm glad to be here. Of course, I'm going to for minus two. So. Good evening and welcome to everyone. Um, my name is Kofi Anani uh, Dosu. I am an African, regardless of where uh, I grew up. Uh, already I can see I grew up in Dahomey, which is the actual Benin, but I don't see that territory to be my land. Anyway, um, 
I am here as a member of the African Continental Unity Party, and most importantly, as a member of the Free Minded uh, Pan African Academy. Uh, our duty as Free Minded uh, Pan African Academy is to train new leaders in business and in politics in Africa. And then our vision is to rebuild Africa as a global power base. But we believe that we are weak. That is why we are uh, more treated anywhere we go. And we need power. And power comes from unity. Not power as it stands now in the world where you are powerful when you have the ability to destroy others. Our power comes from unity. Our ability to protect each other and to keep our, ourselves uh, as human and to protect nature. Uh, so basically, that's why I'm here. I'm here with my team. Maybe my team member is up there. He will explain very better. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, good evening. My name is Sephas Oyo. I'm a lawyer, and I'm here on the invitation of uh, the organizers of the group, and I'm um, to share with you the legal regime and the framework for foreigners who wants to invest in Ghana. And I'm here with the, the immigration officer. So when it gets to our turn, we will explain and share with you the legal regime for investors in Ghana. 